Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Brandon, and today there was a new hotfix, a new playlist update that got implemented in the game today. And you can find this information out on charlieintel.com. I have a screenshot up on the screen for you guys to pause the video and look over. If you don't want to do that, um, I will be leaving a link in the description for that website, so you can do it that way. Um, on uh, Charlie Intel, they released an article that says Domination XO now live in Call of Duty World War II through March 26th. And that will end on a Monday at 10 a.m. So let's go ahead and get into this and see, you know, what they mean. And so basically it's um, the party size is still 1 to 6 players, uh, you know, per party, and then total, there's going to be 8 to 12 players total. And the time limit is unlimited. Okay. And and uh, the score limit is 200 points. And now, instead of uh, it being 50 points per kill, now it's 100 points per kill. So it's up to where, you know, all of us has been wanting 100 points per kill. So now it is 100 points per kill. But, you know, like I said, the catch to all of this is it's only going to be available until the 26th. And, you know, let's hope that they implement the 100 kill, well, the 100 point per kill in general and regular domination but I'm really not seeing that happen but who knows if they do then I will give you guys that information so but that is that and in addition to the playlist update they they added a Volk weapon contract and that is extended to the 27th which will be uh, Tuesday so go ahead and get your Volk. Um, you know, more people that's gonna have it. So you know, that's okay, I guess. I mean, I get annoyed with that weapon, but it's like so good. But yet at the same time, if everybody uses it, it gets really annoying. So, um. Anyways, that's a new playlist update. Um, the actual hot fix is they fixed an issue where care package parachutes were not taking damage and detaching. And I don't really know too much about that because I don't run care packages or emergency airdrops and stuff like that. I, I don't do that. Uh, there was two weapon tunes and... The first one is MP40. They had a slight recoil buff. So I don't know the specific details on that. Um, I do know that they did buff the recoil before and before, well, pre patch, it made a vertical right recoil, uh, recoil pattern. And now they had it more centered vertical. Um, to have it more easy to control made it kind of similar to the PPSH So I don't know what else um, That helped with it after this patch uh, I have to do some more testing and see about that so uh, The other one was the type 100 was buffed um, they slight fire rate buffed it so I'm taking it that they increased the uh, fire rate by how much I don't know how noticeable you know how uh, noticeable it is I don't know I have to test that and see um, I'll, I probably will do a video showcasing uh, two weapons and see how they are and I can let you guys know what the difference is in that and if I can and get some information about all that stuff then I can r relay that information to you guys and uh, if anything go to exclusive ace go to his channel and you know he does in-depth stuff and you know go there and you'll get a better understanding 
I do know that the Type 100 did need a fire rate increase, so I'm kind of happy about that. Uh, to where, if you can notice it, to where you know you don't need rapid fire. You know, I don't know if that is the case. That's kind of cool. That means I wouldn't have to run rapid fire because for me, I only run uh, rapid fire on weapons that I absolutely need to have it on. So, you know, that's just my kind of play style. So, um, the MP40 update, you know, I don't, I don't know if I necessarily agree with it. Um, I'm sure that there's other weapons that could have needed a tuning, like the sniper rifles or the grease gun. You know, now that gun needs a fire rate increase. I mean... I'm pretty sure the rest of you guys would, you know, understand that and probably wouldn't disagree with it. So, and the other thing is um, the Bronze Star adjustments. For the Bronze Star, we are now taking into account kills with lethals, score streaks, and weapon switching. Sledge Sledgehammer Gaming also adjusted the logic to decrease the amount of one-shot kills that are shown. So, I don't really know what that is. Maybe uh, leave that in the comment section and let me know if you know more about that than I do. You know, you know, enlighten me. So, but, um, you know, the other thing is, you know, let me know if you agree with these two weapon tunings. And... If you don't agree with it, you know, put down what weapons you feel that needed to have, uh, you know, a, a buff or a nerf. Um, for my opinion, I do agree with the Type 100 buff, but, you know, as of right now, I do not agree with MP40. I'm, you know, I feel that there was other weapons that they could have taken advantage of for this Offix and concentrate on an, another weapon. So leave a comment down below. What other weapons you felt you, you feel that they could have done too? Um, and if you agree to what they did, then you know, put agree. So another thing, guys, I'm asking for about five likes on the video today. Um, if we can get more than that, then that's cool. But for right now, I'm just asking for five likes. And this is one of the rare occasions that you guys are seeing me snipe. Um, surprisingly, I did pretty good. And uh, overall, I'm a sniper on our GB team for AK. Um, and that and that's the other thing you know go check their channel out they are down in the description go check them out we, ha we have all kinds of montages on there v2 rocket gameplays and all that you know go check that shit out and like and uh, subscribe for them so and they do live streams all the time so you know they're always entertaining over there if you like fortnite Fortnite is also hot over there, so go and check that out as well. And my links to my uh, Facebook, Twitter, Twitch, PayPal, all that good stuff is down in the description. Along with uh, my two sponsors, uh, Cinch Gaming and Fatal Grips. Links to those is down in the description along with my promo code. I have a 5% off and a 10% off. Go down there and check them out. So, um, anyways, I guess I'm going to leave it here and let you guys enjoy a little bit of gameplay. So, without further ado, please like the video, subscribe if you haven't, and without any other thing I got to say, peace out guys, have a good day.